Hello and welcome to the WizIQ Virtual Classroom. In this video, you will learn how you can manage attendees and their activities in your live class using the attendee list. You can give audio control to an unlimited number of attendees. Allow students to use the whiteboard stream up to six live videos, including the presenter, and even participate in a text chat in the class. When your live class is on, you can see the attendee list with the names of the attendees on the right panel of the classroom. You can drag and drop the attendee list from this default location to any other location in the classroom. To manage an attendee in the classroom, locate the attendee's name in the list. You can use the search option to search for the attendee in the list. You can see the icons beside the attendee's name that represent the controls that the attendee has. Attendees can have audio, video, and writing controls, which allow them to have audio and video chat, write on the whiteboard, and share files in the classroom. A grayed out or disabled icon signifies that the attendee doesn't have a certain control. To grant the control to the attendee, click on the respective icon next to the attendee's name. To revoke access to a control, click on the icon again. If you wish to change permissions for multiple attendees, click on Attendee List Options. In this window, select the attendees and then select the permission you want to grant or revoke from the Take Action menu. You can also filter and sort attendees using the Filter By drop-down menu in case there are too many students to manage at a given time. To avoid any disruption caused by attendees during the class, you can block one or multiple attendees. Blocking an attendee prevents him or her from participating in any class activity. A blocked attendee can only view class activities. To block an attendee, click on the attendee's name and then block this user. You can unblock an attendee by following the same steps. However, if you would like to remove an attendee from the class, simply click on the Remove from Class button. You can also divide attendees into groups and shift them to different breakout rooms for discussions, live projects, and other activities. Check out our tutorial on breakout rooms to know more about this feature. An attendee can get instructor's attention to ask a question or present a point during the class using the Raise Hand feature. When an attendee uses this feature, an icon appears next to the attendee's name in the list. You can acknowledge the attendee's request by clicking the hand icon next to the attendee's name. Use the text chat features to engage your students. If you wish, you can also disable this feature for your learners. With all these tools at your disposal, you can take complete control of your online class in the WizIQ Virtual Classroom. We hope this tutorial helped you understand how you can manage attendees in the WizIQ Virtual Classroom. If you still have some questions, you can get in touch with us at support at wiziq.com. Thanks for watching this video. Have a great class.